Okay, what's up, YouTube? Today, I'll be showing you how to mod the Nerf Hyper Fryer. Okay, what first we're gonna do is just unscrew all the screws. There are two right here, and there are two kind of hidden right there. There aren't like any hidden when you cock it back, so you don't have to worry about that. So take off all the unscrew, unscrew everything, pop those things off, um, and then just pop open the gun. You're probably gonna be like wondering maybe what this thing is gonna be for. It's for when you have this, that thing's gonna help cock. So, pop that thing in here. Once I can do it. All right, whatever, I'll show you later. <laughs> that isn't, that's not really important right now. But I'm gonna show you how to mod it. Okay, and then, after you have it, just take this off. This thing right here, just pop that back in place. Then you're gonna have this, it's a pentagon. Shape, they're gonna be screws, they're gonna be five. One, two, three, four, and five. And then your screwdriver. Unscrew them. And then you're gonna have ten of these things right here. And they're all gonna fly out. Well, we start is. Ours did. You're gonna have. And then there's gonna be a spring. You need to keep those. Well, I don't know if you need to keep those, but for my other hyperfire I modded, I kept those. So what you want to do is this thing, just throw it out. You don't need this at all. This, you need. So get your wire cutters. And I just snipped it off. Get it as low as possible. Ow! <laughs> Okay, and then when you're done with that, <laughs> get a flathead like this, and then just cut the things like that. Oh, I already popped it off. Turn on. Should I watch your hair? That's my name. Got that? That's how that's gonna look when you're all done. Okay, when you're done, this can come out. There. That'll come off, and then if you have some needle nose pliers, you can kind of clean it up on the bottom right there. Just clean that up. Just take out your needle nose pliers, and then just take some of the stuff off. And um, that's really all you need to do. Uh, you need the springs right here. Just do that ten times. You don't need this. This is something you don't need. So yeah, just cut these and then use your flathead screwdriver to get this out right here, the little prongs, whatever you want to call them. And so when you're done, you're gonna get your pieces, these, put the spring in first, and then put the seal over. Or at least that's what I do. Maybe you don't do that, but that's what I do and it works just fine. So yeah, that's all you need to do. Put it back on. Just like that. So. Yeah, you're just gonna put it on, do that, just put them on. When you're all done with that, put it together, screw it, make sure you do the five screws. And they should be silver, so. Yeah, and they're all the same, so don't worry about the sizes. Um, when you're done, take this thing off right here. Because that just kind of gets in the way. Then put it on. 
like that. Make sure that the piece that you fit over this piece right here should go in right after this. So this line and then this piece. Then lift it up a little bit. Enough to where you can fit that. Oh yeah, screw this. You don't you don't need that. No, don't worry about that. Don't you don't need that. Put that in. And then you have this. Just just put it in and take it out a little. Like that. See that? That's how it's supposed to be. But this is supposed to be right there. That right there. And then put it back together, screw all the screws in. Remember to put this piece. Uh, that's right. Like this. Under. That way it fits over that. Put the spring over. That's what, that's what cocks it back pretty much. Just cock it. And that's what cocks it. And then your trigger, in case like you mess that up, it, it should be fine. Just put it in place right there. There should be like a little indent right here. Right there. And that's where it should be. And then that works once you um, put it back together. Yep. And that's... And don't shoot it without any screws in. Yeah, don't shoot without any screws in or else I'll shoot up the gun. So put a couple in and then shoot it. And then we're going to put the ranges in the description and I'm Charlie that did the morning and then RJ is the cameraman, is the cameraman, is the cameraman, is the cameraman. Okay, peace out YouTube.